Financial news today for the city of Chico. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Debbie Cobb. Good news indeed for a city that had a multi million dollar deficit just six years ago. Action News Now reporter Laura Ang is live at the city council chambers. Laura, how bright is the city's financial picture? Debbie, the mayor says that the city overcame an $8 million deficit and is now in the black with a $19 million budget. But given the impacts of the campfire, the mayor says he is asking the state for $6 million per year for the next three to five years. This is all in an effort to boost public works, police, and services for expenses from the campfire. The owner of Bird in Hand, Bob Maloney, shared his thoughts with us on the state of the city. It's very interesting to see where we are in this town at this time. A lot of things have changed coming up to this time. I think uh, Mayor Stone had some very interesting points that need to be brought out to the whole people to decide what, we're, uh, what the path forward is. The mayor is also asking the state for $12 million in traffic management to address traffic congestion in the city after the campfire. The mayor did speak as well about what the current housing situation is like and what his future plans are. We're working to have more on that for you at 5 o'clock. Reporting live in Chico, Laura Ang, Action News Now.